we're on 59th Street and we're about to start walking to 5th Ave. Um, only two problems is that my ankle is hurting right now and I gotta walk a couple blocks because I have to go to Uniqlo in 5th Ave and I'm taking advantage of getting off the train early just to get a little walk in so I can shoot around and take advantage of this summer, or not this summer, this springtime uh, vibes. But yeah, let's see what we can get on this whatever. I'm trying to find things that are interesting to catch my eye. I missed that shot. <laughs> I definitely missed that shot. <laughs> light shining on these people right, right here so I'm gonna try try and take just a nice I want to get a photo of that yeah. thank you yeah. putting this off somewhere what is, I, where's this gonna go it might be on Instagram might it might be, be on Instagram. YouTube what's yeah. your Instagram handle uh, Maddox and my M-A-T-I-X-C-Z there you go. Thank All you. Right. Hey, what about you? Uh, I'm Dutch Maz on the internet. Okay, okay, -C -C -C. cool. C-H-M-A-Z-C. We're live right now. Oh, okay. What's up, everybody? Good to see you, man. <laughs> Good to see you. Enjoy. Oh, I ran out of battery. been an hour since we since we left work and currently wow. oh and my watch died so I'm currently struggling I don't know what it is uh, whether it's because I haven't been out shooting for a while or because I don't know nothing really peaks nothing really peaks my interest but uh, I think I think the main problem is that I went outside or I left work with high hope. Like the whole day I was pretty much looking forward to leaving work and just getting out to shoot because of the nice weather and and the sun sets a lot later now, but uh, nothing is piquing my interest. Maybe because I'm tired as well is why I can't really see anything right now, but I don't know. We're gonna keep pushing through. I keep looking at my watch that's currently not on. 525 and the sun sets in about an hour and a half so we're gonna go to this book off that is across the street that I didn't know existed and then we're gonna head to 42nd Street and keep shooting see what we can find before the sun sets Yo, so in the last clip, that's pretty much all I recorded. Um, as you can tell, I wasn't really feeling it that day. Uh, and literally the whole entire time, I thought I wasn't getting any good clips or getting any good shots, really. Mainly because I had a high expectation of the nice weather, uh, the sun is out for longer, so there should be things that I should be picking up. Uh, and I was expecting to shoot like every single minute, like every single minute I was expecting something to happen, which is not the case. Uh, and I, on I honestly don't know why I came out with that mentality after work. And I think a big factor was also because I was tired that it felt like I wasn't really getting anything. And then when I got home, like I, I saw that like there was, there was a decent amount of pictures that I actually liked that I got from this walk. Uh, so 
it goes to show how much mentality plays when you're out uh, shooting around. And and the only reason why I stopped recording is because I I just felt like nothing was really happening. Um, and so like it didn't feel like and also like i i don't know why i was feeling the pressure of the camera that i needed to be shooting and making content like almost every second but i didn't need to and, and after after that like i slowed down my pace like i i lowered my expectation not expecting anything to really happen hopefully you guys like these kinds of videos i kind of like it it's very low maintenance to edit and record um it was just today that like i just felt off but yeah let me know if you guys like these videos comment like subscribe all that stuff uh comment which picture was your favorite and if you want to follow me on instagram that's where i post most of these photos but yeah i think that's it for me today